to another very exciting video series. In this series, we're going to be talking about Intercom. Intercom is really awesome. We're actually going to be using some of the existing technologies that we used in some of our previous videos, including the Metabase, um, the Metabase deployment, and Metabase is good for data visualization. And we're also, uh, we may even talk about this GitHub repo uh, eventually. Uh, that's another ongoing series. It's called the uh, Modern Day CMS project, and we might even integrate the Intercom code into this project eventually. But first, we need to go to Intercom, and very simply, you just uh, sign up, and this is the page that you're going to get taken to. Everything is totally new. And I want to do customize the intercom, install Intercom, sync your data, and install Intercom Messenger. Okay, so we want to do this. To install Intercom, choose how you, you want to sync or connect your data. So let's see. I want to do it via a single page web app. And to install the countries that you want to sync or connect to your data, choose this method. If your web app uses asynchronous JavaScript and rarely triggers full page refreshes, add this code on every page you'd like to display Intercom Messenger. Copy and paste it right before the slash head tag on each page. Copy code. Okay. And luckily for us, if you've been following with uh, along with our modern day CMS project, we have a head that goes on every single page. This is a beautiful thing. CD, MySQL, Node, Angular, and Nodemon, server.js. And let's open up the Sublime. Sublime. Okay, core.js, we go into our partials folder, and we said right before that closing head tag, so that's got to be over here. Okay, right before our closing head tag.